Hey everybody, you are on the lot with Stephen Hill here at Landover Southwest Houston. Right there. And want to show off a first edition Range Rover Sport. This is a pre owned one and we just got it in yesterday. Here we go. Bam, there she is. So this is a first edition. Um, it is a V8, uh, 4.4 liter V8 with 523 horsepower. It made it through with the 23 inch blacked out wheels. It has the Brembo brakes, so the bigger brakes on the vehicle. It does have the black pack, as you can see. Show you the back end where you see all the quad exhaust pipes. We have not had a chance to change it out, so uh, this is not where I work. the tech package so if you look up in the um there's, oh, there's a camera up here which uh, translates into the rear view mirror i'll show you that in a second let's go finish the 360 around the vehicle they're not making this car currently you have to wait until 2025 production for them to be making the v8s again so the first edition was kind of a limited run so, uh, super rare car very blessed to have this car. Let's check out the inside together. All right, so I have the keys in my pocket. Just push the button, it's gonna open. Has a blind spot, has the ebony interior, and has the carbon fiber trim on the inside. Beautiful. These buttons are hidden until needed. They'll light up back when we need them when we start it up. You can see the first edition tread plate right there. Current mileage is 11,051. There you go. And you've got your adaptive cruise control, your driver nanny, your heated steering wheel, volume controls, radio station controls. You can answer any of phone calls. And I like this uh, black chrome that you're using on the car. You can see it on the steering wheel as well. And you also have the air conditioned and heated seats. There's air conditioning. I think I have that one on YouTube to show off. And you have the massaging seats as well. So you can turn those on and you can actually choose the different massage programs. Alright, let me go and turn that heated seat off. Here we go. And you also have the camera system, which is pretty amazing as well. So I'll just uh, show you the front of the car. All the way around, you want to make sure you're not curving your wheels. Just like that. And this is the first edition. Got the refrigerator underneath. Passenger seat. Upper and lower glove box. And then the clear view rear view mirror, so you can, um, it's, now you see me, now you don't, which is pretty neat. Suede headlining, big panel roof. Oh, and then uh, head up display, because it has a tech package and head up display as well. All right, let's check out the back seat. All right, here's the back seat. So you got more of the uh, carbon fiber on the doors. It is power, so I can actually uh, set these seats up a little more upright. I'll lean them backwards. And you also have a full, you know, proper charger for your um, laptop computer, and then some uh, USB Cs and a uh, circle charger right there. And you can see the big uh, panoramic roof right there. This um, back seat is the same legroom as the old full-size Rover. And the reason it's that way is because you have a two inch longer wheelbase on the new Sport. So uh, it's two inches longer than the previous generation Sport. It's a big deal, guys. All right, and going to the back, you can go ahead and raise this up, show you the space in the back. There's three cubic feet more space in the back of the car than there was last year as well. A lot of that has to do with the cutout over here, but this is a little deeper as well. And you can actually fold the seats down right here or raise and lower the height of the truck. Alright, close 
down. Oh, there's one thing I forgot, hold on. All right, I forgot to show you, and this is a little tricky. I'm gonna try to do it one-handed. In order to um, raise and show you the spare tire, I have to pull this tab and this tab at the same time. So let me just do that real quick. And I'll go one-handed. So see, I have a full-size spare back here. All right, hang on. Also, there's a cool new feature back here. If you pull this one, you have a built-in cargo storage area. So keep your cargo from running up there when you hit the brakes really hard. You can also um, put your bottle of wine or any kind of um, item you want to keep uh, secure in those little bungees. And these can be slidden um, left and right to create the gap that you need. And then you have to push this button and this button pull right down. Pretty cool. Now we can close it. All right, guys, thanks for watching the video. I do have some static photos. Uh, they're going to roll right now. Take a moment, please. Uh, click the uh, like and subscribe button for me. It really does help me. You are on the lot with Stephen Hill. Land River, Southwest Houston.